Hi Sagittarius, welcome in. You're watching the Sacred Sun Tarot. This is going to be your reading for the upcoming month, the new month, right? Let's see what's happening for Sagittarius all placements, all right? Reverse the roles if needed, switch the cases. This may not be your reading entirely. Moon rising, Venus, Jupiter, and Sun. Sagittarius. Let's see what's happening in your life in this month. Tower, oh my god. Libra got the same energy as the overall energy. Boom. <laughs> Universe is throwing that over you, Sagittarius, and this is unexpected. I see Ten of Pentacles energy, beautiful, happy home. Oh my God, okay. So, this can be a sudden proposal of long-term commitment for some of you and it is very unexpected. I see Ace of Wands and Ten of Pentacles here. For rest of you, this can be a big struggle coming in because maybe you're already committed and there's a third person who's really interested, right? And quite ignorant of the fact that you're already committed. If you're not committed, right now then i think this is a potential proposal coming in which is very strong but some tower moment is associated here so sudden awakening sudden messages something very quickly is going to happen and it is going to be very unexpected right it is going to uh, strike you for a while okay sagittarius all placements what's happening here we have the strength in the center of the reading. Very, very resistive, right? Leo energy here, Scorpio energy here. You're looking to you're looking at something, Sagittarius. Something is exciting, something is catching your interest, right? But you don't want to go there because of some reason. For some of you, this can be that you already have someone in your life. For rest of you, this can be that. You want to practice restraint. You want to stay away from the situation for time being, right? What's blocking you? The King of Cups. Somebody is in love with you. Can be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio here who is really into you. This person is coming in as the blockage. Maybe that's the reason why you cannot move forward in a particular situation because the person you love or the person who is in love with you, the person, this might be the one you're dating, might be your partner, that particular person is not letting you move forward in that situation, right? For some of you, I'm strongly picking up that this is going to be a third party situation. Not really third party, but uh, a proposal, right? An unexpected proposal. All right, what's, what's your surroundings this month? Six of Swords. Somebody is going to understand and move on. I see that there's a departure. Somebody is moving every, moving away from the uh, turbulence and moving towards calmer waters. Maybe because you're turning them down because of some reason. What was the past for Sagittarius? Ooh, you are tough. <laughs> you gave clarity to somebody. This is my situation and this is what is happening. I cannot work with you. You're cutting out something. You have done it, I think. You've already done it. You have given your words to somebody. Six of Wands. And you, I'm picking up a very happy energy, Sagittarius, that you're quite excited about a proposal. Something came to you and you're very happy about it. I see you getting a lot of attention and... Uh, you're enjoying that attention, right? Uh, yeah, I definitely see proposals. I definitely pick up proposals. We have the sun here. Oh my God. You're very happy about something. This month I'm picking up Sagittarius. Something, some things, not just one, but multiple. They're going to come to you. Opportunities, proposals, passionate offers. I'm listening here. That is going to make you feel very happy, as if all the eyes are on you and you're enjoying the attention, you're enjoying the communication, you're enjoying the words from others, right? So where is it heading? Oh, we have the Four of Cups. And the moment that situation goes away, this is going to be very boring. <laughs> you know, sometimes we are center of the attraction. All the people look at us. We are popular suddenly and everybody is just like, I want to talk to Sagittarius. But when that situation ends, 
it, it won't last forever, isn't it? It doesn't last for anybody. So uh, I think when it ends or when it will end in future, you're going to be like, I'm bored now. <laughs> but we have the Wheel of Fortune here, so don't worry. When one thing ends, something better is waiting for you. This is going to be a big chapter, right? Big thing. Something beautiful. A lot of popularity, fame, attention I'm picking up for you. So how is this person looking at you? How are they looking at you? Page of Cups. Uh, I think this person sees you as somebody very compassionate, vocal, sweet talker. But something, because of something, it's like an apology that I'm sorry, I can't do that. Something like that. We're going to clarify over it. Okay, Emperor. Just give me a second. Emperor came out of the deck. So we'll put it back. I did not ask the question. So how are you looking at yourself? How are you looking at, at yourself? Four of Pentacles again, the four energy. You're not ready for it. There is something which is stopping you. Four, four, Emperor, four. A lot of fours on the table. I think you are at a stable position and you don't want to risk it. There's some risk involved in the opportunities you have right now and you don't want to risk them. Hopes and fears. Arrofant. Are you guys already committed? Right? For some of you, this can be commitment. This can be family, society. Hoping for a very traditional connection, connection in your life and you don't want... Uh, in and out proposals you don't want uh, random proposals or flings we'll clarify it further what's coming out of it what's coming out of it finally oh my god your connection is intact if you are in a relationship this is the most beautiful relationship right and if you're not in a relationship i think a relationship is coming sagittarius if you are single you're falling in love and if you're not, then I think you're turning somebody down. For some of you, I'm picking up that even if you're single, you're going to have a lot of options. And even if you're committed, so many options, right? Of course, the person you are in love with or you are with right now, they're going to hate it. And I think I can sense it here. Ace of Pentacles, right? New offers, opportunities, not just in love, but finances, career, even work life. All right. Sagittarius all placements. Uh, what is this strength energy? What are you restricting? Why is the King of Cups in the blockage? Right? We have the Hermit in reversed. So um, I think there was one person who helped you to come out of your Hermit mode. There was some past associated. You released something. There was some lessons. There was some healing. There was some, some bad phase I'm picking up. And there was one person who helped you sail through this, right? And I think the hermit phase is over. You have given thought to the situation. You are done with thinking. Knight of Pentacles. Okay, the offer opportunity is here. And the two of swords. I think you have made the decision in the past already, Sagittarius. You have made the choice with whom you want to be, right? If you are still, if you're still single, I think uh you are having opportunities and you're very confused about it i strongly pick up that in the beginning of the month you're not making any decision maybe because of lack of clarity right we also have ten of cups here oh my god i i really pick up a big relationship here if it is not there right now i think it's happening this month what is the six of swords why is this person moving away from sagittarius the knight of cups the ace of swords and the nine of cups all right they got the clarity. This person came in with the proposal, very lovey-dovey kind of energy. They came in and came in with the proposal, but very soon they got the clarity that either you already committed or you're not available. Whatever reason may be, but you're not available for them. They're getting this clarity. I see this person turning out to be satisfied. I don't really see anybody getting a broken heart. Though they are going to feel rejected for a while, but they're not really getting a broken heart. You know, it was like... They saw you, they got attracted, I see attention here, a lot of attention, and they just asked you out. And then they realized that 
OMG, Sagittarius was already committed. <laughs> that kind of energy. Not really a big thing. I don't see that uh, somebody's getting broken heart or something like that. Big, big issue here. Not really. I see two of cups here again. Right? Let me see what is this page of cups. Why is this person uh, considering you as the page of cups? Seven of wands. Okay. So you're turning them down and apologizing. As simple as that strong energy of multiple options you are actually the center of attraction this month Sagittarius I pick up so much attention over you what is the six of wands we have the moon the eight of swords and the six of cups all right hmm there's one proposal from your past and probably that's the reason why your current partner is not very happy about it there's some proposal from your past, right? It's not that you are not in love with your current partner. I see a lot of love and uh, deep connection. But there's someone who is actually bothering you. Why I'm saying bothering you? Because I can see some kind of attachment here. Some kind of connection with past. Maybe you have moved on and you have a beautiful new thing in your life. Maybe you're married now, you're happy, you are in a relationship, you're committed and everything is going good. But somewhere at heart, you do think about the past person. It's not in any unhealthy manner, but some kind of memories I'm picking up. And those memories sometimes tend to block you. I see some kind of uh, uh, eight of swords energy, you know. Everything is fine, but when I look at, when I look back, I can remember everything. That is the kind of energy. And I don't know, you, you're feeling sad about something, Sagittarius. It isn't that bad. I don't feel depression or any kind of very bad energy. But it's just a thought I'm picking up. You know, something is making you feel a bit disappointed about past. For example, I'm very happy where I am. I'm grateful to God what I have right now. But what if that situation could have worked out? You know, that kind of situation where you're thinking about a past situation or a past person and you're wondering what if that situation could have worked out and uh, things would have been different. You know, that kind of energy. That's it. Nothing much. Nothing to be worried about. All right, what is this Four of Cups energy? What is this Four of Cups energy? Something suddenly from your past is coming back. Either this can be simply like you're bumping into your ex, maybe in the supermarket or maybe at the superstore or uh, grocery store somewhere. You're just bumping into your ex or somebody you moved on from and suddenly you just realize that, oh my God, we had something. You know, that, that memory comes back just that part nothing else what is this four of cups and that is going to oh we have the tower the lovers and the fool okay my god <laughs> three major arcanas back to back again that same situation i'm picking up that something is going to happen suddenly with the tower energy here and uh, you're going to miss something from the past right some memories of the past are going to take over you but last not the least I see you jumping into something beautiful, right? You are initiating something good in your life. This can be a love. This can be a love relationship for some of you, but this is going to be beautiful. I see lovers, you have a beautiful choice here. And to stay in that connection, I see you resisting somebody. What is this two of cups? What is this two of cups for Sagittarius? The five of swords, the king of wands, and the five of wands, all right. So for some of you, this can be that a person who backstabbed you in past is returning as well. And there's a beautiful person who, with whom either you are in a relationship or you're thinking of getting into a relationship, right? And uh, this past person returning, making an offer or whatever, trying to approach you again is going to be a big push from the universe that you have to end their cycles, end everything you had with that person and you have to jump into something really new and beautiful, right? I see maybe in past or in the recent energies, or maybe right now, you were postponing a big decision in love in your life, right? But suddenly something is coming from the universe, and this is going to be in the form of an ex. 
nasty ex or somebody you don't want to face somebody you don't want to experience uh, that person i think backstabbed you i can see the five of swords energy here and that is going to be a push from the universe to actually embrace the beautiful new opportunity coming towards you right i see that something is going to happen and suddenly you will jump into a beautiful new connection real quick real real sudden and just unexpected and it will be like okay i'm ready for it <laughs> you know that that is something i'm picking up clean it up clean up the past energies the moon the eight of swords the fears the insecurities bad memories of past just clean it up something beautiful is waiting for you we also have the cosmic gateway your thoughts are magnetic and powerful miraculous changes are occurring and that is what is that is what it is that is what we are picking up you know something beautiful is about to happen death i am learning that endings are merely beginnings and that is what we are talking about since the beginning embrace this new beginning in your life and i think a push is going to come in from the universe so sudden so unexpected that you will be forced to make a decision and you will jump into something new right and suddenly all the past memories will be gone the negative emotions will be gone the negative uh, experiences will be gone what will left behind will be some good lessons and a beautiful new journey with a beautiful partner right overall it's a very positive energy sagittarius it's just that you were delaying a decision and universe is going to step in and force you to make that decision right because it is for your good and for everybody's good right so this was your reading for this time period thank you so much for watching bye bye